Hey there, this is Santos Rolon Jr. here on my YouTube channel. I've got a uh, maybe a short holiday message I want to uh, share with, with you on the other side of the screen as well as myself. You know, most people want most people want to have more in life. Most most people want to have uh, a success of some kind or another. You know, most people want more money. They want a bigger house. They want a nicer car. They want to be able to have the choice of freedom to do whatever they want to do and go wherever they want to go. They want to be happy. They want to be smiling all the time. They, you know, most people don't want problems. I mean, who wants problems? Do you like problems? Do you want problems? This world that we live in is a difficult world. You know, it's a difficult world. And you and I have choices to make every single day. You know, we, we make choices to wear certain types of clothing. We make choices to go here, to go there, to eat certain kinds of foods. So we have choices. And you know what really bothers me sometimes is when people say they want something, but yet they're not willing to do whatever it takes. You know, I'm not perfect. I'm not perfect at all. In fact, the background that I come from is a horrible background. You know? But I, I, I made a decision. I made a decision some time ago and I said, you know, I'm going to make an impact in the lives of other people. I'm going to make an impact. <clears throat> but that impact first had to be done in my life. I have to get up every single day and visualize. I have to get up every single day and do some reading. I have to get up every single day and do something for my business. I have to get up every single day and watch the videos that are going to help educate me to keep my mindset on this journey that I've been on for some time now. Stinking thinking is not where it's at. Doing the same things over and over and expecting a different result is not where it's at. Talking about what we should do or what I would like to do or what I uh, am going to do is not where it's at. We gotta start, we gotta start talking, you know, I must. I must do this. I must, I am going to do this or do the other thing. Because success is not given to any of us. Success is not going to be given to you. It's not going to be given to me. We're going to have to pay a price somewhere for success. And it starts right up here. It starts with the way we think and it starts with the way that we speak. And if we want something bad enough, we also have to believe and how in the world are we going to believe? How in the world are we going to achieve success if we're hanging around the wrong people? If we're watching the wrong things or listening to the wrong things or listening to the wrong people? How in the world do we expect to achieve success? It's not going to happen, my friend. It's impossible. We can sit here and deceive ourselves all we want. We can deceive ourselves all we want, but I'll tell you what, unless we're going through, unless we're doing exactly what it is that we need to be doing every single day, unless we're talking to ourselves on a more positive level, unless we're, unless we are doing whatever it takes for us to keep our mindset at a peak level, it's not going to happen. We can talk. I talk to people all the time. They say they're going to do this. They say they're going to do the other thing. They don't do it. And, and in fact, some of them even hide from me when I reach out via phone to connect with them. I'm not here to hinder people. I'm here to try to help people. But I realize, you know, most people are afraid of success. Most people are afraid of discipline. Most people are afraid of positive people. They are. Uh, you know, I hear that, uh, you know, misery loves company or misery loves misery and you know i'm just i've had my butt kicked so many times 
and I still lose every single day. Not afraid to say that. I lose every single day. I fail every single day. I told my son, who's 18 years of age, he's getting ready to go into the Marines pretty soon. I told him that, you know, and I told my daughter too. I said, you know, I'm going to die trying. I will die trying. That's the kind of mindset you have to have if you want to succeed and you want to do something better with yourself. You got to have that kind of a mindset that you are willing to do whatever it takes and you're going to die trying because success for some of us may take a lot longer than for the rest of us. Success is not a straight shot. It's failure upon failure. It's breakthrough it's from breakthrough to break breakthrough. It's from day to day. And you got to be willing. You got to be willing to believe in yourself. You got to be willing to ask for help. You got to be willing to humble yourself. You got to be willing to put yourself in that arena where you can actually succeed. And if you're not doing that, my friend, if you're not putting yourself in that arena, you can talk about it all you want. It ain't going to happen. It's wishful thinking. You know, I think about all these great people, these leaders, these internet marketers, these speak speakers online that, that we watch their motivational videos and people pay thousands to go to their, their seminars, thousands of people. And you know how many of those people come out of there and do what, what they hear? I would probably venture to say that it's a small percentage, a small percentage of people. But those small percentage of people go out and change themselves and they go out and change the world. And you and I both, we have a gift. And we're either going to develop that gift or we're, we're basically going to bury it. It's a choice. What are you going to do? What are you going to do with your gift? What are you going to do with your talent? What are you going to do with your life? I believe in you. I know that you're, you're capable of great things. I hear that from people like Les Brown. Zig Ziglar, Anthony Robbins, Dr. Maxwell Maltz, and many, many others that I listen to. Earl Nightingale, the Bible. The Bible has a lot to say about the way we speak and think, too, even though we're all sinners. But you don't have to put yourself down every day. You don't have to beat yourself up every day. Learn to forgive yourself. Learn to love yourself. Learn to associate with the right people. Learn to associate with the right books. Learn to associate with the right videos and succeed in life. It's the only way, my friend. We're getting ready to head into 2017, and I'm getting a head start on my year. I hope you do the same. I desire for you greater success this new year. I desire for you a greater self-development, a greater self-mastery, a greater optimization of the paradigms up here in the subconscious area. Because this is where the true battle is. It's right here. And controlling this thing right here. And learning to use these things a lot more. With that said, I'm going to end. Comment below. Like my video. Subscribe to my channel. If you want to connect with me, you want to talk about success, you want to talk about mindset, you want to talk a little bit about neuro-linguistic programming, my information will be below the video. And there'll also be a, a, a link in there to, uh, to a business platform that'll help you if you're in business and you want to take your business to the next level. With that said, this is Santos here, making every single day a super fantastic, terrific, over-the-top day, daily in spite of and because of. I'll see you at the top, and I'll see you on my next video. Peace.